Hi, my friends. Welcome back to Rosie's Creative Wings. Um, coming back with the second part of my Timo haul. So this part here is mainly all crafty items. So I'm going to start with this um, memo pad watercolor um, little palette. This is from Semi Art. Semi Art. S E A M I Art. Um, and so, of course, I'm going through Timo and just checking out the paint and just buying um, the ones that I think I would want to try. And so I found this little palette here, which is great for travel. Um, it brings 24 colors. And I thought that I would get it because, like I mentioned in the first video part, that I'm planning a trip with my daughter to Puerto Rico. And so... I thought that maybe I can take something like this with me just in case I feel like getting crafty or artsy and I thought this one was pretty cute this little set here it was pretty pricey it was $13.98 but I wanted to try it so it has these little paper shit and I think these are for um, so I can put, play with the paint on top of it I think that's what it's for if I'm not mistaken and so the little container is or the palette is um, metal they did have it in like a baby pink and a baby blue a light pink and a baby blue but I decided to take the black one um, comes in this little ziploc bag which was nice um, I think these are like little um, papers for to brush the paint on um, it does come with this here what is this let me see what this is here is this a pen Can open it. Oh, okay. Oh, that is super cute. I didn't even know that. It has a little brush. It's a travel brush. Okay, that's really cute. I really like that. So I do have um a set of travel brushes, which I've used once or twice, but um I can probably take those with me too. And they're similar so you see it has like the screw on brush which is super cute that's super cute and look at the brush tip that's nice I like that But I also have these here that I purchased from Amazon. And this is way before Timo, but I would have definitely purchased it from Timo instead. But anyway, these are pretty nice too. So these, you unscrew them, and then you have your brush and you put it here. So these are great to have as well. And they come in different sizes. That's the smaller one. Same thing. So I'll probably take this with me too. So that's like the same concept. But it comes attached to the palette, which is great. And then what is this? Oh, okay. One of them came out. It has little magnets. That's cute. That's really good. And so it brings a lot of colors. So these are the colors here. I'm going to do a little swatch on another video. I was also interested in trying out these colors because they look really dark. Like you see that pink there? I definitely want to try it. And I wanted to try the brand, See Me Art. I see that they have a lot of um, different types of paints on Timo. Um, and so I wanted to try that brand, See Me Art, because I keep seeing it. And so depending on how I like this one, because I definitely like the Timo paints that I bought before. And so I'm enjoying those a lot. So I want to see and explore a little bit more of the other Timo paints to see. So anyway brings 24 in this little palette that's not bad right look how cute that is oh so look at that so it has like a so the paint i mean sorry the pen is what holds it that's very cute this is a really cute gift too i think this makes a really pretty gift like for a man you can get it in black that is super cute i really really like it so for $13.98, I think the price is worth it. 
you take off the pen and then you open it so yeah stay tuned guys i'm gonna do a little swatch on this little palette soon and these papers i guess you can use this to do the art or whatever i think that's what they gave it to you for but i guess that's what it's for but um of course i'm gonna use bigger i'll take an, a little pad which i'm gonna show you what else i ordered so if i do take it with me i'm gonna take a little um art, book, art pad or something like that that's super cute i really like this I just want to try out the um, the paint and the swatch just to see if they're good. So stay tuned for that. I'll come back with that. Okay. So with that, um, I did purchase this um, sketchbook. Um, the sketchbook, like a little art pad um, book. And I like this Japanese um, design, so I picked this one. They did have it like in the red. I think it was red and other designs, but I wanted like the darker one so that it could match the palette. But I also like that design. I preferred the more neutral darker colors than the bright ones, so I selected this one. This is really pretty. And so I do have something similar to that, a little black art book, and um, I love that book. Oh, and look, this also has the pen holder here. At least I can just put something in there. Then you can put in here. See? It's great. Um, I do love that little art book, so I said, you know what, let me try this one. I don't know how the paper is, so we'll try this one. It has the <clears throat> elastic here to keep the book together here. Oh, that's nice. I think I may have to buy another one of these. That's pretty nice thick paper. So this is art paper. It did say that it had um, art paper. Of course it's art paper. Watercolor paper. Um, it did mention that it had watercolor paper. That's why I purchased it, but I wasn't sure how thick it was going to be. And I am surprisingly very happy with this paper. Very nice. And this design is really pretty. So, oh, in the back it has a little pocket. And that's nice. You can carry, like, I can carry, like, little pieces of collaging. Um, papers in there. Stickers. Like, if I want to color something and do a collage, I can do that. Put some little pieces in it. Keep them in there, right? really nice I definitely love this design as well look at that very pretty four five what did I say it was five five ninety eight I'm definitely gonna get another one I think it's really pretty and the paper quality is really good so yes I think I'm gonna take another I'm gonna get another one and I'm gonna take one of these with me so I love that very pretty very good so I also bought um, this here this is a white permanent I think what I read was a white permanent um, marker of course all the wording here is Chinese so I'm going according to what I remember what I read when I purchased it and this is what it looks like here. This was a dollar dollar ninety eight. I just want to see. Ooh, that is really nice. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to get more of these. Look at that. I always buy one because I don't know how they're gonna be, right? Let me write my name. And then I got it with the long, long. They do have regular, the regular point. But I wanted to try this one. And look at that on black. It looks really good, that white. So, yeah. 
a dollar ninety-eight. I'm definitely gonna try more of these. I wish I knew this. This is a seven, uh, seven millimeter point. I would like to get like a five. I like it a little bit smaller sometimes. I use both. Um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna go back to my order and see if I can find the other ones. There are some other different ones that have the point a little different, but yeah, I'm going back to this and checking that out again. So this was a dollar ninety-eight, pretty good white. It says that it's permanent, so that's what also draw me to it. So um, I found these here, these really pretty colorful butterflies. So um, it says that these are crystal, like crystal butterflies. I honestly thought that these were a different um, material. So these look like they're the um, transparent stickers. But they're so pretty. So these were one fifty nine, but they were different prices. So let me see. So like I said, I had two different orders, and they put them together. So I have I have purchased two and two, and they all came in one. So, um, but I noticed that the blue ones were one fifty nine, and. Um, I don't know which other one was 159 and then the other ones were 179 so it's between 159 and 179 I just want to take these out oh my god that is so pretty look at this paper look at that paper alone isn't that gorgeous this is just gorgeous see stuff like this I'll just take it and save it you can definitely use that for a really pretty card for your journal isn't that pretty I love that and so look at these guys oh my god these are gorgeous though seriously gorgeous wow let me see something okay look at that i'm gonna put them here so you can see them a little bit better so you see they're transparent but look even closer so you can see them they're gorgeous aren't they look at that so it has like a little gold trim. They have like a gold trim around it, which is really pretty. Look at that. See that? So that's why they call them like crystal, because look, when you move it around, wait, let me see if I can focus. They're gorgeous. So these are the blue ones. But you can see other colors in there. It has the little ones. And they're stuck together so you get two of each. Wow, these are gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Beautiful. But I definitely thought that these were going to be... See, so if you... They're together. You get a lot, too. Super gorgeous. Um, so these are the blue ones. So I did get them in all colors. They have four colors and I took them all. So I'm definitely going to use these for projects. Um, and if I see that I don't make use of them like I should, I do, I'll give them away because they're too gorgeous to just keep them from using them. These are the pink ones. Oh my God, these are so pretty. Look at that to the rabbit. It's so pretty. That's so pretty. Wow. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. They're just stickers, but these are really pretty. Look at that. Gorgeous. And they're different in designs. Look at this one here. And this one. So you see they're different. Yeah, those are super gorgeous. They have little and they have them like this too. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that one. I really like these. They have the little ones.
wow. So, so pretty. Gorgeous. For those of you that love butterflies, and I have a lot of sisters here in on YouTube, my friends, my sisters that love butterflies, and so I know that if they see these, they're gonna want to get them. So, and they're gorgeous. So I recommend that you do. So we did the these are the blue and the pink, and then these these are like um like a neutral, but I see a little bit of blue in them, but these are darker. can't get over the packaging it's so beautiful yeah this one has it does have the blue but it has also like that neutral so pretty oh my god it is so pretty focus please focus it's not focusing come on come on come on okay it's not focusing let me see if you focus this with this one better come on okay anyway you can see it a little bit there beautiful these are super gorgeous love these wow they, these are pretty these have different ones so I feel like they're all different all different colors but all different styles See that? That's gorgeous. I love those. But I thought that these were more like um. I thought that I, I didn't think that they were flats. I didn't think they were stickers. I thought they were more dimensional. That's why I saw them. I was like, oh, I kind of thought that they looked like um. Kind of like you know those um pins, something like that, but in a uh, crafty type of sticker but I thought they were more dimensional these are more flat but they're still beautiful and then this one is the green which I love it's like a subtle such pretty green you can still see like hues of blue and look at that oh my god that's gorgeous I love the wrapping yeah this is so pretty look at that gorgeous oh my goodness I really love these look beautiful look at this big one oh my gosh look at that one those are gorgeous Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Look at this big one here. You can see those colors. Look at that, the crystal. Kind of looks like, reminds me of like uh, the glass. The stained glass. Kind of like that. Beautiful. I love these. I thought they were different, but I'm not, have, I'm not upset that I got these because they're gorgeous. So, yeah, so I got all four colors. So if any of you that see my video, you're interested, let me know. I'll send you the link if you want to. Is that okay? Then I found, um, so now I'm going to show you some stamps. So I've been trying to look for stamps for mark making for my art. Uh, I found this one here. This one was 224 and that is what it looks like. It's just for mark making. These are perfect. 224. And I think I ordered two of these, so I found that one. Here's the double. So I'll probably give that away. That's 224 for that one. Then I found this one here. This one was 127. I like this one too. I wish it was a little bigger though, but I like this one too. So that's that one there. Let me see if I can get something you can see better. So that one just has like little um 
bookmarks and like writings and stuff like that which I like that one was $1.27 then I found this one here also marks this one was $1.71 And that one looks like that. I found that one. Then I found this one here, and this one is for swatches. So the only thing is that I noticed that the squares are really small. So um, I thought that the stamp was going to be bigger. But I can definitely still use it. And there's one here on the side which I can definitely use, which is bigger. So that is what it looks Let me take it out of the plastic so you can see it better. But I thought, since I'm always doing swatches, I could probably use it. You see, these are really small, so I don't know. And even these are small. But I like this one right here that I can probably use but I have to restamp it a whole bunch what I'll do is I'll probably just do one and scan it and then uh, whenever I need it I can just um, print it onto a page and use it like that but then again I do have my swatch book which I need it to fit in there because I don't want to have my swatches all over so I think I'm going to make up something with this one here so that it fits into that swatch book and I'll use that from now on but we'll see we'll see this one was a dollar 78 uh, then I found this one here which is really tiny it's really cute a dollar 78 as well and the marks are super cute but really small that would take me a long time to do a whole paper of these But you know what, when I get bored sometimes and I don't have like, and I get like an uh, artist block, I tend to take out my stamps and things like that and just play around with them. So maybe I'll do that when I don't have anything creative to create. So that's that. Um, and then I found this one, which I thought was super cute. You know what, let me just show you this one here. This is another mark making one, which I really like. I think this one is so cute. Wow, oh, it has a lot of cute ones. But also a little bit small, but I'll make it work. I can definitely make really pretty papers out of this. That's what it looks like there. You see all those little marks right there? This one has a little heart in the bottom. Really cute. This one was $171. And then I found this one here that I've had in my cart for a while and I wanted I wanted it for a while. These are some light bulbs. Oh, that's really cute. Look at that. definitely do a really pretty art page with that. See the light bulbs? Stinking cute. That one was $1.98. And then I found this one which I loved because it kind of reminds me of my abstract art. It's a weird looking stamp but I like it. Oh, let me see if I can open it. And that is what it looks like. Yes. Really nice. Let me see if you can see it better here. Very nice. And that one was a dollar eighty-eight. So that's for the stamps there. Now I want to show you. Um, I bought a whole bunch of stencils. Um, this one was a pack of 16 <clears throat> and this one was five dollars and 48 cents 
<clears throat> so for 16 packs, this is really good. Let me just put them here. So I thought those designs that I showed were really um, unique. And I'm looking for things like this. Look at that. That's unique. So that's one. So some of them I can, um, I like more than others. That's really cool. I like that one. Those are pretty cool. Sixteen. It's been sixteen. I can definitely make really like unique papers out of these. Look at that design. That's awesome. The heart, that's pretty cool. I like that, I like that. That's cool. And a shell. And this one. So yeah, I'm happy with this pack here. The 16 pieces, 540, what is it? 548, that's not bad. I wish they were a little bigger, but that's fine. Um, that's that. Then I found these here. So this one was 178, and this one was 148. Um, so I'm just trying to look for different designs. I wish these were bigger though. Have a little bit of pieces that we have to. Okay, so this one is this one here. And then this one looks like the script one. I thought this one was a lot bigger. Like that one. And then there's this one here, which I like a lot. I'm just going to keep these out of the bags for now. That's those. So one was 148, the other one was 178. And then I found this one here. So I like these new designs um, for stencils. This one was 148, I like that one a lot. But like I said, I thought they were much bigger, but that's okay, I'm gonna use them like that. That's one, this one is 179. And I really like this one. I do have to clean out some of the stencil parts there that one looks like leaves to me that's pretty so the bigger one was 179 and the smaller one was 149 and then I found this one here I like the design this one was a dollar 98 look at that one Pretty cool, and then this one here was also a dollar ninety-eight, and I really like this one as well. A dollar ninety-eight each, and then this one, of course, came very bent, but really tiny. Um, this one was a dollar twenty-five. But I like the pattern of it, the leaves. I do have to flatten it though. Put it somewhere where you can flatten it. I like that pattern, that's why I bought it. And then I found this one as well. This one was $1.48. That one was $1.25. So that one was $1.25 and this one was $1.48. That's that one there. I like this one for mixed media, that one's great. So that's that for these. And then I found a pack of, I think this is three, three or four for $2.48. These are a little bigger, which I like. Oh, so it brings four. That's that one there. 
that's pretty cool I like that design this one there's this one oh this one's cool too and then there's this one and these are great for, for the jelly printing yeah this this pack was really good for 248 yeah again if you're interested let me know and I'll send you the link okay or I'll put the link down below whichever so that's that and then I found oh this one little one here it snuck on me um, this one was $1.78 these, these are so fragile and so small and I gotta look at sizes because um, although very pretty they're very um, flimsy but that's really pretty and these these bend because these are the more um, uh, sensitive ones they're very fragile so but that's pretty that one was $1.78 and then I found this packet here for $2.48. And I think they've been caught as well, but these are much bigger. See, like this, they're worth definitely buying. Let me see if I can open this. My fan is on, so let me put it this way. Oh, so this one is pretty cool. Look at that. That's cool. And then you have this one here. Ooh, I like that one. And then you have this one here. It's getting caught. And that's pretty cool too. There's a little piece here. I don't know where that came from. That's probably from here. Oh, right here. Isn't that cool? That one's really cool. I like that one. See the flowers? And then this one here. I like these new designs that Team was coming up with. I really like them. So that's why I was drawn to them. Because these are great for jelly printing. And this is kind of like the designs that I'm looking for. That I can use for collage. They're perfect. So yeah, that's four, and they're large. Sensu for two forty-eight. Happy with those. I wish I can find them all this size, though. Or even the other ones, the first ones that I showed. The these, even this size, I'll be happy with this size as well, too. Yeah. The smaller ones I can still use, but I prefer the big ones. So that's pretty good there. Okay, so that's it for these stencils. And I think I have just a few more items to show you. And then we're done. So I'm going to use this as a mask. Um, so I found this scissor here for $2.98. I love that it's black. And I'm obsessed with scissors. I thought it was going to be like this. Like this big one. Because I like the big scissors like this. But... Of course it's not, but I really like it. Look how pretty it is. If the, I'm gonna look for the bigger one, but I really like this. And it's like, see that, you hear that? You can tell it cuts good, let me see. Yes it does, so yeah. But I just love that it's all black, really pretty. So that was $2.98. Um, then I found here this woodless charcoal pencils. Um, how much are these? These were $2.98 for my art, of course. It's good to use. I do use charcoal. This is the charcoal. Um, I'm sorry, this is graphite. Um, these are the charcoals right here. But I was looking for different ones, so this one is the medium, and this one doesn't have um, the wood, it's just woodless. So I'm going to try those and see how good they are. 
And then I found white charcoal pencils, which I've never used. And I don't know how long um, they've been around, the white charcoal, but I don't think I've ever seen them before. So I said, let me get um, a set. These were $3.48. And I can definitely share these with my husband because he also does art. So I can... Um, oh, they're different. Let me see. Soft. Yeah, this three soft and three medium. So I can give him one of each. And this one too, I could probably... Soft, medium, and hard. We can share these. Yeah, so the black charcoal woodless charcoal pencils were $2.98 and the white charcoal pencils were six piece were $3.48 um, and I think that's it guys I was going to grab something else but there's nothing there <laughs> so that's it my friends for my Timo haul I do have one more order that I'm waiting for um, it should be coming fairly soon because I did place these orders kind of like one after the other so I do have another one coming up not too big not like this one but a few things so um i'll definitely bring that to you guys when it comes in so thank you so much for joining me again if you are interested in anything you saw here today let me know and i'll link it down below or if it's one of my sisters you guys could text me and i'll send it to you so thank you so much for joining me um i hope this video was not too long and i hope you guys enjoyed it and thank you so much for stopping by and i'll see you in my next video god bless Thank you.